오늘의 핵심 패턴으로 복습해 보겠습니다. 첫 번째, be more like a 아니면 be more like an 해서 뭐뭐에 더 가깝다라는 뜻의 패턴 연습해 보고요. 교훈을 얻다라는 뜻의 learn one's lesson. ones로 그러니까 my나 your, our 형태로 연습을 해 보겠습니다. 이두 가지 패턴을 이용해서 만들어 볼 영어 문장의 우리말 번역부터 보여 드릴게요. Be more like 명사를 이용해서 첫 번째 문장. 그녀는 저에게 여동생에 더 가까웠습니다. She was more like a little sister to me. 뭐 친구라기보다는 여동생에 가까웠다 이렇게 말하고 싶다면, She was more like a little sister to me. 같이 읽어볼까요? Repeat after me. She was more like a little sister to me. She was more like a little sister to me. Great, let's take a look at our next pattern. 다음 문장은 그 프로젝트는 실험에 더 가까워요 라는 문장인데요. 이걸 이용해서 The project is more like an experiment. The project is more like an experiment. 발음 연습해 보죠. The project is more like an experiment. The project is more like an experiment. Great, how about we move on to our second pattern. 두 번째 패턴은 learn one's lesson입니다. 교훈을 얻다. 이걸 이용한 첫 번째 문장은 그는 지금 아니지만 언젠가 교훈을 얻을 거예요 라고 말하려면 he will 또는 he'll learn his lesson someday. He'll learn his lesson someday. 발음 연습해 보죠. He'll learn his lesson someday. He'll learn his lesson someday. Perfect. Let's take a look at our last example. 마지막 문장입니다. 그들이 교훈을 얻은 것 같아요 라고 할 때는 I think they've learned their lesson. I think they've learned their lesson. 큰 소리로 읽어주세요. I think they've learned their lesson. I think they've learned their lesson. Perfect. How about we take one last look at the clip with both English and Korean subtitles. When I was a kid around five or six, I used to be a little bit of a class clown. <laughs> well, actually all throughout high school too, but that's for another time. But in kindergarten, I had a friend and we loved to sit together and goof off. Now, usually the teacher would just tell us to stop. But on this one day, I guess we were really noisy, so we got in trouble. And the teacher made us go stand outside. I guess she thought that having us stand outside together would be some kind of punishment, but it was actually more like a reward because now we could talk as much as we wanted to without anyone telling us to stop. <laughs> but by the next time, I think the teacher had wised up because instead of telling us to wait outside, she gave us a warning card that we had to get signed by our parents. Definitely after that, we learned our lesson. We stopped talking with each other during class time at least while the teacher was paying attention. 오늘의 알쏭달쏭 영어 표현 한 마디 소개하겠습니다. Okay. 아까 빌리 씨의 이야기 속에서 mm -hmm. 어떤 이야기를 하려다가 그건 that's for another time. Oh, that's for another time. 나중에 이야기하면 좋겠다 이런 이야기를 했었잖아요. Mm -hmm. 그런데 그 나중보다 조금 더 가까운 시일 내에 잠시 후에 그 이야기는 좀 이따가 할 거예요. 라고 mm -hmm. 어떤 주제를 끝내고 mm -hmm. 다시 돌아와서 이 이야기를 하자. 
그 이야기는 나중에 다시 할 거니까 넘어가죠 라는 의미로 쓰는 말이 uh -huh. You can say, we'll come back to that later uh -huh. We'll come back to that later 네, 이야기를 꺼내다 보면 은 A 이야기하고 B 이야기하고 C로 넘어가야 되는데 yeah. B 이야기를 너무 오래 하면 안 되잖아요 right, right. 그럴 때 We'll come back to that later. Yeah. We'll come back to that later. 네. Let's move on to C now. 그렇죠. And then we'll come back to B later. Come back이라는 것이 돌아오는 건데 우리 mm -hmm. 나중에 이 이야기로 돌아올 겁니다 라기보다는 나중에 다시 이야기할 겁니다 라는 뜻으로 yeah. 정말 많이 쓰이는 표현입니다. That's right. One last time. We'll come back to that later. Okay. Great. Let's move on to In the Social World. <웃음> Let's take a look. I just want to have fun at school, so when I graduate, I can talk about all the times I got in trouble and had fun. When I asked my son if he had fun at school today, he said, well, I got in trouble nine times, so yeah, I had fun. <웃음> 네, 다시 한번 볼게요. Slim says, I just want to have fun at school. 그냥 학교에서 재미있게 보내고 싶대요. 재미있는 시간을 보내고 싶다고 mm -hmm. 합니다. 뭐 공부를 많이 하고 싶다 이런 거 아니고. Mm -hmm. So, when I graduate, mm -hmm. 여기서 so라는 것은 뭐뭐 할수 있도록이죠. So that. Yeah. 네. So that. Uh, when I graduate, 졸업. I can talk about all the times I got in trouble and had fun. Mm -hmm. 그래서 졸업할 때 아, 내가 이렇게 많이 말썽을 어, 부렸고 그 다음에 혼났고 mm -hmm. and had fun, 재미있었다라고 말할 수 있도록 지금 I just want to have fun, 그냥 재밌게 놀고 싶어 라는 말이고요. Interesting. And Marky says When I asked my son if he had fun at school today, he said 제가 아들에게 학교에서 오늘 재미있었냐고 물었을 때 이렇게 말했습니다라는 내용인데 mm -hmm. 영어에서 정말 자주 묻는 질문이죠. How was school도 많이 묻지만 yeah. Did How you have was work today? Yeah. Again? How, oh. How was work? 쓰지만 학교 이야기할 때 oh, right. Did you have fun at school? 많이 묻잖아요. Oh, yeah. Did you have fun at school today? 네. 그래서 딱 그걸 질문했을 때 He mm -hmm. said, well, I got in trouble nine times. 아홉 uh, 번 혼났어요. So, yeah, I had fun. Mm. <웃음> 그러니까 재미있었다고 볼수 있죠. Mm, 라고 말했다네요. Very cute. Oh, this very cute, mm -hmm. indeed. All right, great. Those are some great social media posts that we had for the day. I just want to thank you guys so, so, so much for sitting here with us today. 네, 저희는 다음 시간에 다시 인사드리겠습니다. We'll see you next time. 감사합니다. Bye.